Hey students, this is just a quick tutorial on how to split a data set. So, um, if you have the general social survey open and you have SPSS open, I believe on chapter 3, homework, you have to split the data set, maybe chapter 4, what you're going to want to do is come over here to this data tab, then click on data. And then what you're going to do is you're going to split file. So when you go to split file, make sure that you don't hit split in two files. You're just going to split the files. And I believe the homework tells you to split the file between males and females. So let's go ahead and click split file. Okay. Now I'm going to right click here and then display variable names because I'm looking for the variable sex. Because it's alphabetized, the variable sex is going to be towards the bottom. So I'm going to find variable sex. Click on that. And then I'm going to organize outputs by groups and then click sex in there. Okay, now when I press OK, the output window told me that the file has been split by sex, okay? Now that I've done that, any type of analysis that I'm going to do from now on, let's just say that I create a frequency distribution for the variable, um, Bible, okay, so people's feelings or beliefs of the about the Bible. Click it in here, press OK. It is going to split males, okay, so the males in the sample from the females. Okay, so this tells you how many males believe the Bible is the inspired word of God versus the word of God versus the book of fables. And then this section tells you how many females feel the Bible is the word of God versus the inspired word of God versus the book of fables. Okay. Now, once you do this, make sure that when you uh, click out of SPSS, that you um, don't save it this way. Because if you save it this way, then every analysis that you're going to run from now on is essentially going to have the data set split between males and females. And Canvas, the homework, isn't going to always ask you to split the data, so you don't want to keep it like that. So there's two ways to go about doing this. The first way you can do is go back to data hit the split file, then just click sex out of that box, and then you're going to be okay. So you're going to press analyze all cases that do not create groups and press okay. And then the output window essentially got rid of the whole split file. The other way that you can do this is by clicking out of the, clicking out of SPSS altogether. You don't want to save the output. We can, but uh, I don't want to. And then you can click out of SPSS altogether and press yes do you want to save the file don't save it okay because you made alterations to it okay so just make sure you don't save it and if you don't save it then any split file won't show up the next time that you open up SPSS so don't save it and then you should be good um, hope this helps